glowing white in the small cottage garden that surrounds our late 19th century gardener's cottage called Lyongate Lodge is this wonderful plant from Mexico. One of its common names is snowflake and you can see why it's covered in these white what look like petals. They're actually modified leaves called bracts or cyathophiles. The actual flowers are right in the center of the bracts held in little cup-like structures. It's called Euphorbia leucocephala and leucocephala means white head in Latin and it comes from the edge of the Sonoran Desert and Baja California in Mexico. It's a drought tolerant shrub for the garden, only grows about two meters tall, can be pruned to shape. Just be a little bit careful though because like a lot of members of this genus, it does have irritating sap. So just be a little bit careful when you're working around this plant. But a wonderful plant for the home garden, fantastic in cottage gardens like this. You'll find it at Lion Gate Lodge at the Royal Botanic Garden, Sydney. I'm with another euphorbia in the middle gardens and this is probably one you're more familiar with. So its common name is the poinsettia. It's euphorbia pulcherima and just like the snowflake, it has these modified leaves or bracts. This time they're bright red. It's also a plant that grows in Mexico and it's really become associated with Christmas. Now this association began in the Northern Hemisphere, which made a lot of sense because these are plants that are short day length flowers. So what initiates flowering is when the nights become longer than the days. So they flower naturally in winter. Obviously for Christmas in Australia, it involves manipulating the conditions in a glass house. So the plant thinks that the days are getting shorter and the temperatures are getting lower. So flowering is initiated so that you can buy these poinsettias for the Christmas setting here in Australia, as well as in the Northern Hemisphere.